Hello, students. Um, let's get out our page that says find the slope. Okay, this is not hard. Finding slope, there's an easy way to do it. And that is rise over run. Rise is counting how many points there are vertical. Run is horizontal. For example, my lines aren't going to be straight because I don't have a. Oh, wait, hold up. I have a new yardstick. All right. Here's my line. Okay? Rise over one. Run. Here we have where it connects with the y-axis and the x-axis, or x-axis and y-axis. The rise, how high does it go between my x point right here and my y point right here? So this is negative three, zero, and this is zero, one. So if you wanna know the difference between or if you want to know what your rise is, take your y values. So my y value here is one, and my y value here is zero, and you subtract them. What's one minus zero? It's one. So for the slope here, it would be one, that's my rise, and then the run. So you take your x value here, your x value here, and you subtract it by your x value here. Okay, so zero minus negative three. Two negatives would equal positive, and so three. One third, so that's my slope. Sometimes slope can be positive, and sometimes it can be negative. So how do you know the difference? An easy way that I remember it is, when you're going uphill, you're going positive. So any line that you see going up this way, from left to right, it's going up, it's gonna be positive. Any slope that you see going down here from left to right, that's going to be negative. So positive, negative, positive, negative. So for example, let's say we see this line. I'll erase this so as not to get confused. This, I see it's going downhill. I automatically know it's a negative slope. Now, point here is zero, three. My point here is four, zero. So my rise, what's three minus zero? Three. And what's the difference in zero and four? Four. So my slope is negative three, four. Now, you've got some practice on this. You need to look at the points they give you and then be able to do what I did just right here. It's not hard, but I, it's, it, there is some graphing practice we're going to do, and it should be fairly easy. If you have any questions, let me know. Have a good day.